Hi, I'm Christo Garcia, the founder of My Swing Evolution. A few years ago, I wanted to rebuild my golf swing, so I picked up Ben Hogan's Five Lessons book. Guess what? It changed my life. Today, I've got the game I've always dreamed of. I'm sponsored by the Ben Hogan Golf Equipment Company, and I even got to swing as Ben Hogan in a special on the Golf Channel. And in this video series, I'm gonna teach you the most important things I learned from Ben Hogan's Five Lessons. In Mr. Hogan's famous book, the third chapter is the first part of the swing. I just call it the backswing. And the most important thing that I learned about the backswing was to keep my rear leg braced. Yes, this rear leg is going to be the brace for the trail side of my body as I turn around it like a post. If my leg is going all over the place, I'm not gonna be able to find a consistent position at the top of my backswing. So if you can learn to brace your rear leg, you're gonna be in a much better position as you take the golf club back. Now, Mr. Hogan took the club back in an order that was very clear. He had a little caddy drag, okay? That means he had a little flexibility in his wrists. So he would start with his hands first and then the arms, then the shoulders would turn, and last, the hips would turn around as he took the club back on that famous plane that we're so familiar with. Mr. Hogan believed that there was a pane of glass from the golf ball up across his shoulders that gave him a sense of where the club needs to be. He didn't want to break that pane of glass. He wanted to keep the club underneath it. That keeps the club on more of a single plane rather than reaching up high and bringing the club into a secondary plane over the shoulders. Now, I was having trouble with this in the beginning, and Roger Dunn, the famous Southern California golf teacher and store owner, suggested to me, take your lead hand and reach in the pocket of your opposite hip. Suffice to say, it worked, and I haven't looked back since then. And finally, the most important thing I learned about the backswing was to allow my hips to open on the backswing. And Mr. Hogan talks about the importance of the lead leg breaking in towards the rear leg. Now, we don't want the knee to poke out towards the ball. We want it to break in towards the other leg, which allows the foot to roll to the instep on the backswing. He wasn't too worried about lifting the heel really high off the ground. He wanted the foot to roll in, and that's what caused the heel to lift. So I really suggest you allow your hips to open on the backswing. This is going to allow you to have a longer swing, and it'll give you more time to execute a great delivery into the golf ball. So if you'd like to learn more about how I swing the golf club, go to MySwingEvolution.com and check out the My Swing Evolution golf system. And if you'd like to check out the best golf clubs in the world for the price, go to Ben Hogan Golf, and I've got a link in the description box below. Hit them long and hit them straight.